You're watching WMAR 2 News. There's new information on the massive Powerball jackpot win in Maryland. Good afternoon, Maryland. I'm Christian Schaefer. A single winning ticket for the $731.1 million Powerball jackpot was sold in Western Maryland. The winner bought it at a convenience store called the Coney Market. That's in a town called Lona Coning in Allegheny County. Over the phone, the owner of the store told me they've not been especially busy lately. The winner has not come forward and they don't know who the person is. But that store gets a $100,000 bonus. Also this week, a store in Hagerstown sold a winning Powerball ticket worth $2 million. In less than 24 hours, indoor and outdoor dining resumed in Baltimore City. Mayor Brandon Scott lifted the ban, which lasted nearly six weeks. Starting 6 o'clock tomorrow morning, restaurants in the city can open at 50% capacity for outdoor dining. 25% capacity for indoor dining. Customers will be limited to one hour and they'll be required to sign in and out for contact tracing purposes. In Anne Arundel County, restaurant owners say the county needs to increase their capacity and let them stay open longer. Last week, a judge ruled that the county's restrictions can stay in place, but the Maryland Restaurant Coalition is fighting for 50% capacity and to push closing time from what it is now, 10 o'clock, to midnight, the county executive Stuart Pittman says there's been a steady increase, though, in case numbers, and that's why he extended the executive order, keeping those restrictions in place. And now from WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. Happy Thursday, everyone. Mostly sunny skies in store for today. And with that slight breeze out of the south and west, that's really going to help boost our temperatures above normal once again into the upper 40s and the lower 50s. And we keep that sunshine around uh, through around uh, 3 to 4 o'clock in the afternoon. And winds will stay on the elevated side, but will start to subside as we head into this evening under mainly clear skies, which will help our overnight lows range in the upper 20s and the lower 30s as we start off your Friday. Partly cloudy skies and start for Friday with highs around 46 and then temperatures trend a bit cooler as we head into the upcoming weekend. 36 degrees for Saturday afternoon, 38 for Sunday and then there is that slight potential for some rain, even some flurries as we head into Monday evening, which could linger into your Tuesday. Thanks very much, Stevie. Stay with us online at WMR2news.com all day long for updates on top stories and breaking news. And for news and weather on the go, you can always download the WMAR2 News app. It's in the App Store or follow us on social media at WMAR2 News. Thanks for watching. I'm Christian Schaefer. This WMAR2 News update is sponsored by Jones Junction.